back, back, back. Back again with another video. And yes, yo, donde esta? And es un, es un, or es Santo Domingo, Dominican Republic, a Republic of the Dominican. So I am in Santo Domingo. As y'all saw in my last video, I updated y'all. That's where I am. That's where I'm gonna be for the next two months. And I'm so excited. I'm so happy to be able to be back on the camera. To be back in y'all's homes, on your phone, on your TV, on your computer, wherever you're seeing me from. I'm happy to see you. I hope you're happy to see me because I miss you so, so, so very much. Yeah, this is day. This is like officially day one, but day two in South of Domingo. For us, we did basically have a full day yesterday. We got in at one o'clock, so we had from one till you know went to bed last night. I'm super excited for this journey, y'all. I feel motivated. I feel like I'm a boss ass bitch because I told y'all I was gonna do this and I did it. I told y'all a long time ago that your girl was going to travel the world and see the world, you know what I'm saying? That I was too big for the little old South of in, in, in Estados Unidos. I'm too big for that. Muy grande. Too muy grande. No. Mi muy grande. Estados Unidos for, for, for the United States. I'm too big for it. So, the first part of my travel journey was, has brought me here to Santo Domingo and I'm happy and I'm blessed and I'm very grateful and thankful to be able to share this journey with you all. So I can show you all at home that yes, you can quit your job. Due to copyright issues, we cannot play Beyonce's Break My Soul right here for a little clip of I just fell in love, I just quit my job. So that was me saying I just fell in love, I just quit my job. Thank you. Quit it. I quit it. I'm not working no more uh, for nobody. Taylor will be working for herself. Um, and that you can travel the world and see new things and enjoy life without having the thoughts of what you're supposed to do to be successful and to be happy. Happiness is wherever you want it to, whatever you want it to be, and this is my happiness right here. So, me, with my love, uh, mi amor, you know, traveling the world. That's happiness for me. And of course, we're bringing, the, I'm gonna get my family to get up and go somewhere too. All the family watching, y'all coming somewhere, y'all getting up out of, the south of the Estados Unidos. We're getting up out of there. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna give y'all a quick, um, this is the house tour or Airbnb tour video. So I'll give y'all a quick tour because it's not that big, but it's cute, quiet, not quiet. Cause it was lit last night, baby. They was out last night. It was Saturday night, so it makes sense. But it's our cute little humble abode for the next two or for next month. And then next month, for the month of July, we will be in Las Tarenas. Santa the Santa Domingo, Las Tarenas, Dominican Republic. So uh, we're here in Santa Domingo for just a month. So yeah, I'm gonna take you around our little uh, Airbnb, and yeah, if you're excited for this video or if you just like me, give me a thumbs up. Um, go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you have not already subscribed because, as I say all the time, we're on the way up, baby. So it's nothing but up from here. Be one of the first ones to be like, I was in that, I was in that first 500, I was in that first 1,000 followers. I've been watching Taylor Renee since so she was first starting out when she first quit her job and started traveling the world. Be those people. Um, but yeah, let me give y'all a quick tour of the Airbnb. Okay, y'all. So here's the tour. When you first walk in, this is our living space. As you can see, we've already made ourselves at home. Kind of, sort of. Shoes at the door, as y'all know. That I do. Yeah, we've made ourselves at home. So this is like a little pull-out, um, pull-out bed couch. You can see we got the fire stick hooked up. You know, RuPaul's Drag Race has to be on. Um, yeah, we got these little bookshelves here. So cute. And you keep going, and here is our dining area. Now we have already moved our dining table out on the balcony because um, we did some yoga here in the morning because baby, the mosquitoes. The mosquitoes are present, and I'm not gonna be doing yoga. I thought I was gonna be doing yoga outside, but not on our balcony until we get like a mosquito net and maybe like a fan or some spray or something to kind of keep them away because I, uh, they ate my ass up yesterday. Not doing it. So, yeah, the dining room table was normally here, but we moved it out so we could do yoga in here. Um, and then this is our little kitchenette space. I accidentally froze the froze the butt. See, there's one seat. If you can't see it, but it's flat. 
but I froze my butter last night because the fridge was not even plugged in. Um, so yeah, I had the I had the uh, butter and the waters in the freezer because that was the only thing that was cold, but ended up freezing them because I forgot I turned it back on. But anyways, our little sink, the stove. Now the stove is not working, but we DM'd the Airbnb host, so hopefully they will come by and check it out. It does come with a few pots and pans. It came with a blender, a coffee maker. There's Madison, beautiful. Um, yeah, a few pots and pans. We got plates, silverware, um, came with a little bar of soap and some cleaning stuff so we can clean our dishes. And then here's the balcony. It's a lock on the thing, you know. Just gotta stay safe. So it's a pretty nice size balcony, like really nice size. Enough for, as you can see, two tables here. It's got a cute little blockage here, so that way whoever's on the next one can't really see us. And this is our view from our balcony. It's, you know, the trees kind of block it a little bit, but um, there's a park, a cute little park from here, all the way over here, and then down there, which I will show y'all in a different video, y'all will see they're having a carnival down there so you'll be able to see that in our walking video so yep oh. and we're on a pretty active street i'm not gonna lie to you we're not too far from like the main tourist strip about like four blocks down four blocks four or five blocks down is the main tourist strip so uh, it's pretty active on the street now here's our beautiful little oh hold on you know you got to use the remote to cut the light on come on Oh, there it is. And it's, this light, y'all, is so cool. Just like this one is also a fan, but it's a light. Because look at it, it's down, and then you can cut the fan on. Yeah. Nice. Pretty cool. Um, there's no TV in the bedroom, which I, I kind of like. I really like that. I wanted to uh, switch to that anyway, like in my own house, because when you're in the bedroom, it's kind of like time for bed. Um, so yeah, there's no TV in here, but it's, it's a nice size mirror. Hi. And we have air conditioning, which is amazing. We got a king size bed. It's lovely. This is our, we are, like I said, we made ourselves at home already. So we've already unpacked our clothes. We got clothes in the drawer. This is our little closet. Yeah. And then this is the bathroom. Um, I was so excited when I saw the videos because I said, oh my gosh, it's a bidet. And I've always wanted to use a bidet. But, unfortunately, this is not a bidet. It's like a faucet. I don't know who's washing their hands down there. Maybe a kid. I don't know. But, not a bidet. Nice toilet. This is the sink. It's nice. It's enough size. Like, it's enough size for me and Maddie to both be in here at the same time. If, like, I was in the shower and she wanted to, like, wash her face or something. Whatever. But this is the shower. It's nice. Now, I can also say that the hotter you make your water, the lower the water pressure. And this it. Look at the muscles. God damn, y'all better not fuck with me. Baby, look at that. Now, now, look at that. Ooh, that's the best part of the tour right there. Ooh, wee. Hey, girl. Y'all look at her hair. You know who did it? Me. It's so cute. So yeah, y'all. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, it's okay. I love you anyway. And I will see y'all in the next video. How do I say see y'all next? Hasta luego. Hasta luego. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's the right word. Peace to the Middle East. Go planet. Decide what I want